somehow we convinced Hazy to go on Space Mountain. Hazy, go, you ready? Two, one, send it. Hello and good morning, everyone. <laughs> Guys, when do you get a hello and good morning from We're right magic. in front? Kingdom. of Cinderella's castle in the Magic Kingdom. We are here in the Magic Kingdom right now. We've got hundreds of people walking by us, staring at us. Staring. We love it, you guys. In fact, today, if you want to play a little game, see how many people look at us as they walk by in the camera. Man, that could be kind of fun. Lot. Count them up, see how many you get. Today, you guys, we are gonna go hard at the Magic Kingdom all day from open yes. to close. They just opened. We're here, we're planning out what we wanna do. So many things here that we love. So many places we wanna eat. Oh my gosh, mom, every time with the food. We walk by, there's like a bakery, a candy shop. Oh She's like, should we go there first? Should we hit that first? We're ready to scream our heads off. We're ready to have a great time here at Magic Kingdom. This is our first so of two exciting. days we're gonna be spending here. Kids are ready, guys. What do you guys wanna do first? I don't know, Big Mountain. Thunder Mountain. Big Thunder Mountain, Big Thunder Mountain. I think we're getting a lot of Big Thunder Mountains. We checked the wait time is only 10 minutes on Big Thunder Mountain. That is not bad. We wanted to do the Seven Dorks ride because it's pretty much all of us plus Maddie. I know. But is it Seven Dorks or Seven Dwarves? I made that joke dwarves, last year. I made that joke last year standing right here. We're reliving so many fun memories though, you guys, of last year when we came, all of the fun so places fun. that we went to. But I think to start the day off, I'm thinking Big Thunder Mountain. Oh, yeah. It's a long-standing Bingham family tradition dating back to my dad. We would always do Pirates of the Caribbean first. My dad's always done Pirates first. That's what we would do in Disneyland every time we went as kids, even as adults when the whole family went, we would go on Pirates. But it's closed right now, so we can't do that. It's temporarily closed. Yeah, so it's gonna be back up and running later today. So instead, we're walking right past it to Big Thunder Mountain Railroad. You want to do it again? Yeah. Okay. Woo! She did it. it Hazy loves it. What did you guys think? You love it? Yeah. Okay. All of our pirating adventurous dreams have come true after getting off of Big Thunder Mountain Railroad. Pirates of the Caribbean back open. Bit of a line, 65 minute wait, but not too bad, and I think totally worth it. Fresh out of Pirates of the Caribbean. That was awesome. That one's a classic. always so fun. And that one's even the best one when it's hot in the afternoon. Oh, you get to go cool off indoors. But guys, we've been spoiled. We've had the most mild weather. It's been amazing. Temperatures incredible. And the line for that said 65 minutes. It was about 27 minutes. So, so guys, that's what we're finding on a lot of these where they have an estimated wait time. It's just not quite right because of the yeah. distancing. You get there much, much faster. So the line's yeah. already not that bad, but then usually shorter and faster than you're expecting. Because after doing a couple of dope rides, kicking off Disney World right here at the Magic Kingdom, we decided it's time to really do up the food situation right now we've done a couple rides we've done you know what right guys got cotton candy colors on right now we got a little bit of pink a little bit of blue that's an indication guys we're gonna do some treats now we're gonna do disney treats right we've heard from you guys on instagram you guys have been weighing in you guys have all said we've got to try the nutella and fruit waffle i've seen pictures of it you fold it up it looks like a taco almost it's filled with nutella fruit delicious so we're gonna go find that at sleepy hollow we're gonna grab some candied almonds one of the kids favorites maybe refill our popcorn bucket but right now recharging with some snacks treats food before we hit up the next set of rides Scenes, guys, this is how you get those iconic shots. Bye, guys. Oh man, you're gonna love it, dude. Okay.
just leaving the Sleepy Hollow refreshment uh, that snack. That was such a good recommendation by so many of you. Okay, we had so many people tell us that, but ironically enough, I saw somebody post on Instagram a picture of it right in front of the castle. Which Wasn't mom it Disney tried. Hungry or something? Yeah, I think it was Disney Hungry. It was all that and then some completely so lived up to the good. hype. One of the first times we really sought out like a highly recommended food item in Disney. We usually just grab the churros or whatever's on the go. Completely worth it. And it wasn't that long of a line. Like the line looked long, but the lines are just not as long as they seem because they go of the social quick. distancing. Yeah, they go quick. Ended up getting a couple of the Nutella waffles. We ended up getting a funnel cake, fruit funnel cake, and then also just a regular waffle for the kids. And we ate every last bit of it, <laughs> it you guys. It was so amazing. Good. Now, I think we're bellies are full. Back to the rides? Yeah. Back to the rides. Another one we gotta hit up, the iconic Haunted Mansion. There's some of them that you just have to do when you come here, you guys. You gotta do like Pirates, you gotta do Peter Pan, Small World, all those things. We're gonna go do Haunted Mansion right now. I know that we've been to the one at Disneyland a ton. We're almost always there somehow around Christmas though. So it's always Nightmare Before Christmas themed, or I should say Halloween, sorry, Halloween. And so this is our first time really, I think, doing it non-Nightmare Before Christmas themed, but then also here in Disney World at the Magic Kingdom. So we're gonna go check out Haunted Mansion next. Let's do it. Coming off of the Haunted Mansion, what did you guys think? It was so fun, I loved it. I love the Haunted Mansion. It's another one of those ones you gotta do, it's incredible. I will say, I feel like I like the Disneyland one a little bit better. I don't know if it's Disneyland that I like better, or if it's the Nightmare Before Christmas theme. It was just super dark in there, I couldn't see much, I don't feel like. But it's fun, it's creepy. I don't know that Hazy loved it, because it's kind of trying to scare yeah. you, and that's not her thing right now. Very dark. We've done those, we've done a lot of those staples. I think we're gonna go hit up a few more. The kids wanna do Space Mountain and the Speedway. They love it when they can drive their own car, so I know we're gonna do that. Another classic that you gotta do when you come, whether you like it or not. Peter Pan and it's a small world. They're just opposite each other. We decided to start with Peter Pan, maybe a small world next time we come in a couple days. So that yeah. is a very long line for it's a small world. Peter Pan, not too bad, getting on right now. Wendy, I can save you, I'm right here. I got, okay. One of the kids' absolute favorites every time we go. They love doing the speedway. They get to race their own cars. They love being their own drivers. So we're dividing up drivers and passengers right now. I think we got it all figured out. There's no way you can hear me, but we're getting on the cars next. The kids were just mentioning this is the first time we've ever done this speedway. We've only ever done it at Disneyland. This one is four lanes wide. This lane, that lane, two more lanes over there. You can get a lot more cars on the road. I don't know what is going on with Ryder's car, but he cannot move. I don't know if he can't push the gas pedal or what. They are stuck. Absolutely not moving. If we get passed by everybody on the raceway. Come on, right now. You got this. I don't know what this thing is. We've all been staring at it, trying to figure out what it is. They're working on it right now. Almost looks like it could be Space Mountain if it were outside. That's Space Mountain. That could almost be like what Space Mountain looks like on the inside. Pretty cool. That's going on the speedway. I don't think there was enough speed for us on that speedway. Somebody in the front couldn't hit the gas pedal. I think his car was broken. He said he had it floored and it wasn't moving, but because that wasn't enough speed, guys, I think we need to go find more speed. Where can we find some more speed in Tomorrowland? Space Mountain. Space Mountain. Let's go to space. Space Mountain, baby. Let's do it. Somehow we convinced Hazy to go on Space Mountain, guys. She wants to go with me though, huh? It's so hard, extra hard, right? Yeah, extra hard. You boys ready? Here you go, you ready? I'll show you, you sit right there. And look, I'm right here. And my legs, sweetie, my legs are right underneath you, okay? You ready for Space Mountain? I'm gonna hold you right here, okay? I don't think we realize that we're not sitting side by side, but she's gonna be brave, sit right in front of me. I got you, Hazy girl, I got you. Mommy's got you right there too, we got two of you. Mom, careful you don't snap your arm off, here we go. Here we go, let's get it, woo! We're going into space, baby. I got you, Hazy girl, I got you the whole time, okay? Three, two, one, send it. We're in outer space. Not too bad, not too bad, not too bad. I still got you, my beauty, I still got you. Not very fast, just in the dark, not very fast. Here we go, I got you. You did it, my sweetie, you did it. You did it. I'm so proud of you. 
over now. Let's check. I'm pretty sure. Wait, are you not crying? Hazel, did you do it? Hazel, I'm so proud of you. What did you think? I like that. Oh my gosh, I'm Wait, so proud. She said I liked it. Hazel, Bingham, you are the bravest princess. I'm so proud of you. What did you think? I liked it. I kind of want to do it again. What? You guys, she wants to do it again. What? What did you think? What did you think? What did you it think? So Casey wants to do it again. I'll do it again. Let's do it again. I love that. I want to do it again. Coming out of the Space Mountain, that went a lot better than we could have ever expected. Hazy girl, what did you think of it? I loved it and I want to go on it again. <laughs> you guys, she literally got done and said she wanted to go on it again. We were a little worried we had tricked her into it, but we were very open. We said it's pretty fast, it's in the dark, but we think you'll like it. It's not super high speed, but I'll be right there with you. And I thought I'll sit next to her, hold her hand. We show up and they're single file. And she's like, wait, how can you hold my hand? I said, instead, I'll sit behind you, wrap my arms around you, I'll hold you that way. Mom can reach back, hold your hand. Got her totally secure and she ended up loving it, you guys. She loves Space Mountain. She was very brave. Crazy. I'm so proud you of you. You are so brave. We told her to be brave like Moana. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, so after that one, we've conquered that. We don't know what we're going to do next. We're just enjoying the gorgeous sun. It's a beautiful day here at Magic Kingdom. We are having such it a blast. It's getting warm, that's for sure. We have really lucked out by walking up randomly on a ton of parades today. We've also got this entire area in front of the castle wide open to take this picture with the kids. I mean, a lot of space to move around here and really cool when you can walk up front row to a parade like that. Now, if you guys didn't catch that at the end of yesterday's vlog, we kind of teased and alluded to the fact that we'll be eating dinner in this castle on our last day here on our anniversary, our 15th anniversary, we're gonna be having dinner as a family. Inside of Cinderella's castle, we've got dinner reservations. We're gonna be closing out our entire trip that way. Absolutely incredible way to wind down the trip to say goodbye to Disney World, to the Magic Kingdom, to our Disney trip, our nine-day Disney trip. We'll be wrapping up inside that castle, guys, so do not miss that one coming up later this week on our anniversary. Guys, this is gonna be one of the best meals we've had. This is Kirby's. We have got these insane loaded tots. It's buffalo chicken tots. All right, guys, beside so himself so with excitement. Amazing. That is mac and cheese with bacon on a hot dog. Then we've got, we got a hot dog with buffalo chicken on it and tots. Holy cow. These tots are amazing. <laughs> Do I have a mask tan yet? Okay, I've been trying to sunscreen, but here's what's funny and ironic about this whole thing. We found this by looking for dessert, so we found these amazing like key lime floats next door, the Peter Pan float that looks amazing. Called the key lime, I don't think it is. It's like a lime pineapple Dole Whip with Sprite. Anyways, that's what we got here for. Then we saw this place next door that was closing down, so they had like no lines. So we grabbed a bunch of this food first, then we'll go get some ice cream. I don't think we've ever done the food as good as I'm we've done it today, you guys. Up. It's about time we did the food good. The fizzle with the Peter Pan flow to Never Never Land. They gotta give us mad props. We are killing it on the Disney food front today, more than we ever have before. I think we've had, would you say, some of the best Disney food we've ever had? Ever. I mean, honestly, between like the Nutella waffle. So many good things. Unfortunately, our kids can't go to college anymore because we've eaten so much <laughs> stuff. We've had a great time Hey, eating. in the words of Stephanie Ravelli, being homeless because of Disney food, probably worth it. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> because we have been killing it on the food front, there's a couple of rides we've left hanging, but we realized we're coming back. We got another chance to get it. So I was telling mom, the main ride I wanted to do at Hollywood Studios was Smuggler's Run, Star Wars Smugglers run. Didn't get a chance to do it, but that's okay. Going yeah. back. Yeah, we're gonna have time to do that. Soon. The main one I've been talking about doing here at uh, Magic Kingdom since the minute we walked in is this one right here, Seven Dwarves Ride. Haven't had a chance to do it. But that's okay. We're gonna come back. I'll get a chance to do it when we come back. So two great rides to look forward to that we have not yet done. Yes. When we go back to these parks again for the second time. So very much looking forward to that. Finishing off with treats, food games strong here. Maybe gonna hit up a couple kitty rides on the way out, but nearly calling it a day. Our first full day at Magic Kingdom today. And it's been magical. It's been magically delicious. <laughs> Would you believe me if I told you Winnie the Pooh is actually secretly one of my favorite rides? Yeah, it's it is. so oh weird God. and trippy, but it's so bright colors. It's so much fun. Great finish to the day here. Taking a ride through the mind of Winnie the Pooh. Oh shoot, we're gonna go up. Oh boy.
we gotta do it. We're gonna close down this vlog with oh, the castle man. right behind us. And I love how well you can see the castle. There's not crazy amounts of people Guys, here. It's actually it's really great. it's amazing. And it's just been a magical day, start to finish, at the Magic Kingdom. Now, we are coming back here again for our anniversary. On Thursday! We've got a Hollywood Studios yet to come. Tomorrow is a full resting pool day. I don't know how much resting we're gonna do because we're gonna hit that yeah, pool hard. Say. Every square inch of that pool. So make sure you come back. We're gonna have a ton of fun with that. We love you guys so much. Thanks for hanging out with us today. It was absolutely magical. And we will see you guys all tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Bye.